I sense that something new was in the making, a new reality. Moving toward 2044 is an incentive to clearly articulate our North Star, a construct and an understanding that we will all look at and that will inspire and drive our strategic choices. Something significant and positive have transpired over this past day. And I believe the YMCA will never be the same again. It's important for, for us to discover and to move forward to this North Star. Uh, it's important because we can't do separate. I think um, we can go quickly when we are alone, but together we will be stronger, of course. And this lovely Padare concept is, is from ancient Zimbabwe. It's a chance for us to share our wisdom and our experience. And there's this lovely vision of leaders from across the country coming together and meeting under a tree to share their, their wisdom and their experience so as we can progress a positive way forward. They jolted all of us out of our COVID shell shock then youth-led solutions, they truly energized us to go forth and undertake efforts to face the pandemic. And it will go on record that this historic moment of YMCA history, our first global strategy, was witnessed by over a thousand attendees from over 120 countries and over a thousand virtual attendees. Congratulations. This is our moment, this is our time, this is our Vision 2030. It's our time to ignite change. YMCA leaders from various countries in Africa gathered in Nairobi from the 10th to 12th November for a series of governance meetings. It was also an occasion to share more about the Africa Y 3.0 and Vision 2030. And the board president's meeting most important outcome was a collective declaration to commit the national movements to the Vision 2030 and discussions about how the African movements will embed the Vision 2030 in their strategies as well as the implementation framework. I don't visit 2030, what we wanted to do with it major activity we did is to pull together a group of leaders from all over the world in here in Lausanne, Switzerland to say what do we do with that. It was actually really historic after years of co-design with young people from around the world. For the very first time in our 178 year history, Worldwide landed on our first global strategy and that's Vision 2030. And what's really special about that strategy, it gives us an opportunity to align what we do here in Australia with the work of the Y across 120 countries. In that spirit, my friend, go forth and ignite. Ignite wholeness, ignite hope, ignite responsibility, ignite dignity. Together, ignite.